Hello and welcome back to your favorite YouTube channel, Time Travel is Possible. Today we're going to review the early 80s genre of breakdancing. Uh, lots of things came out of there that we're going to go over. Um, this is going to be 1984. I thought it would be um, good to review this uh, Breaking Moves by the New York City Breakers poster. Um, this is going to have, this is going to tie in with a lot of the uh, marketing that they did around the breakdancing in the early 80s. You know, you're going to have the movies that came out, like Beat Street was pretty popular, and Break In and Break In 2. Um, there's probably some other ones I'm not thinking of. And then, you know, you're going to have Rocksteady, you have the Roxy Battle, you have Mr. Wave, B-Boy, uh, Ray Dawn. Uh, who was the actress in a lot of those movies. Um, you know, they made it on the Soul Train. So I thought it'd be cool because it definitely affected me growing up. Um, these are one of, you know, I bought the cassettes. I bought, um, I bought any stuff that came out. And in fact, this poster, it's hard for me to even believe I still have this poster to this day. It's pretty beat up. I did search out for it on the internet, was only able to find one that was out there. And you're looking at a few hundred dollars for uh, something that's in good condition. This obviously isn't, and it has holes. Uh, it has the pinholes on the side, but that doesn't bother me so much. And then the other thing I have is this, um, what looks to be, and what I used for a Michael Jackson glove, but uh, the Michael Jackson glove was very different um, because it had it had the sparkles and the diamonds going all the way up. Um, and then this one, I think, would have came in, like, a plastic bag, uh, set type that would be more, uh, breakdancing related, or it could even be Madonna related, I'm not even sure. But this is, once again, another thing I wore, um, you know, when I was doing my Michael Jackson, uh, routine, and it doesn't fit me at all now, and then we're talking about when I was eight years old. So I do have some clips that I want to show in relation to that, and then we'll get into the poster. The first clip is uh, me uh, attempting to do some uh, backspins and some uh, uh, top rocking or whatever you want to call it, um, and body popping, uh, just like here in the poster. Now everything, you know, it, this poster, we'll talk about that. So I'm going to show this first clip. And we'll then we'll come back from that. So there's that. There's me, you know, opening up things at Christmas Day, being excited about all that, uh, having to test my moves already. My friends and I would always do, um, you know, the crazy moves that we would see in the movies um, or whatever we felt from the beat of the music at that time. I am going to try to make this short. So breaking moves by the New York City Breakers. Uh, you know, they have some break dancing instructions here. Um, they also have what we're going to see here um, is they have a lot of uh, lingo, um, dis dog, dis dog, to be fresh, here we go, disc dog, bite, chill, fresh, front, frontin', homeboy, homegirl, over here is jerk, Max out, run, squiggly, track, up rock, whack, word. These are some of the words they wanted to teach you. And then here you have the electric boogie body popping. And this is very difficult to, to follow. It would be easier to do a, a video uh, with some instruction, which there is some out there. I saw one on Vin Diesel back then. Some funny stuff if you go search uh, videos. But, you know, how are you going to learn from this 16, 20 stage instruction? 
And then moonwalking, obviously everybody knew that, and that was Michael Jackson made that famous, but the history of moonwalking is pretty fascinating. Uh, Michael Jackson was pretty good at it. And then he's the one who made famous top rocking. Here you have the uh, instructions and pictures of top rocking. And then footwork, if you wanted to work on your footwork. Now once you go down to the ground, that is seems to be the hardest part of breakdancing. Those guys were able to do insane stuff. Um, a lot of it documented in those movies I talked about. And then everyone wanted to be able to do the head spin. Now I could do the head spin like one or two rotations, but then I'd just fall down. I'm a pretty tall guy too. And as you can see here, we have the, the 1984. Um, yep, and there it is. And then uh, on the back, it's just all white. So I'm, I don't, like I said, I don't know how I kept this poster. It obviously came folded up in something. I'm not sure what it came folded up in. If you guys remember this type of stuff with the poster, um, you know, how, how that would have came to be. Um, it looks like it came folded up in something. Or if you know how this glove came to be, uh, once again, it would have been in some packaging that you probably could have bought back then. And, you know, this is probably the stuff I requested and, and my parents were able to get it for me somehow. So, uh, just thought it'd be fun to talk about that, go over those memories. Very happy to have this New York City Breakers poster still and have kept it all these years. It does hang on my uh, basement in the wall. I mean, on my wall in the basement. And then, here's the last video that I'm going to have uh, going away here. Is the uh, one of me doing my Michael Jackson routine at a Halloween party. So, I must have been Michael Jackson a couple times. Uh, during that and then check out if you like what you're seeing check out everything else I've done a lot of reviews uh, You'll find that there's about 50 videos almost we're coming up to and I've done a lot of reviews on toy guns uh, Vintage blow molds from Christmas Halloween evil Knievel tons and tons of reviews on vintage Star Wars Vehicles with the box vintage GI Joe vehicles with the box Lego castles moon boots and the, and the list goes on and on and i'm just continuing to try to find more and more stuff so thanks once again for watching um your favorite youtube channel time travel is possible i'll see you guys in the future